another tough schedule, basically just like last season. Um, how do you guys feel about that? I mean, I got to go back one game at a time. I don't see it any different than what we had last year, really, like, like you said. On defense, who are some of the younger guys that are under the radar that we don't know about that have kind of made a, made a name for themselves to you or just the way they've been playing? Well, I've been liking Cliff Matthews and Akeem Gustis since they both got here. So I'm a big, I'm a big fan of Akeem Gustis. I just think he's just a beast. Difference maker? Yeah. So many of the guys have been named to all SEC team stuff like that. Is this a defense that is going to be capable of keeping up with the No Sean Marinos and the Matt Staffords and the Tim Tebow's of the SEC? I mean, I, th I think we can. I mean, but it's, like, it's all up to us. It's just the will. What, what did you guys learn from that slide last season? I mean, what, what have you guys figured out and now you're taking into this season to make you a better team? Just got to stop beating ourselves. Mm -hmm. Touch up on the little things. Just, stay, just, try to, just try to make it, just know your assignment, really. Just go 100% all the time. What's Coach Johnson saying, y'all, and how different is he from Coach Nix? It's not really too much of a difference. I mean, they're really kind of saying the same thing. Mm -hmm. For the most part, it's just, it's like the Nix last year, we kind of, we kind of made him look bad by not making certain plays. And right. and so, I mean, it's, it's not really a coach's thing. I think it's more player. What's... What should be the realistic expectations of this team? What, what should the fans expect right now from the South Carolina Warriors? For us to go hard from start to finish. And hopefully give them the best game. Yeah, well, this being, um, I know that's the team's goals, and this being your last season here, and the lot of scouts will be looking at, where are your personal goals being your last year here before you go in the NFL? Uh, I want to at least uh, try to contribute to the team and, and try to help us win more games than we did last year. You know, it was a goal coming in here. I wanted to be a part of something that's never done here before, like, and trying to win an SEC championship. But, you know, we don't want to set the bars too high right now because we did. We kind of fell in the slump last year, and, you know, we're just going to try to take it one game at a time this year. Now I know you're looking. You said one game at a time, but obviously three of the top uh, of the, uh, three of the teams you're playing this year are in the top season, preseason six, including Georgia, number one. How daunting is this schedule looking to you right now? We're going to have a very hard schedule, but, you know, I learned one thing about playing in the SEC, you got to bring your A game each and every weekend because the weekend that you don't, the other team's going to walk away with a go. Do you guys feel any pressure that it might be your job to kind of keep us in games, you know, 17, 10 games, you guys have to stop teams all the time, do you guys feel any pressure? No, we don't feel any pressure because uh, defense wins championship. If it came down to it, we really have to is it the best defense we have so far? We got the chance to be, but I wouldn't say we, you know, we haven't proved nothing yet, so we got the chance to. What is the lessons you guys have learned that you're going to take in this season to make it a better season? Uh, well, what we take in from last year is this, we got to learn how to finish. You know, we lost five in a row and we made a lot of mistakes and people got hurt, but we got to learn how to play. You know, other guys got to step up and I feel like, you know, this year we got a lot of depth on defense. Somebody go down, we got people that fill in for them. We just learned we got to finish, you know, we got to get in the, it's coming, started this summer about getting in the weight room, you know, finishing the drill, finishing the drill. And I feel like if we go out there this year, we'll be a whole lot better than finishing. Maybe if the offense struggles, it might be those 17, 10 games that you guys have to squeak out all the time. Do you guys feel that pressure? Oh, not really, you know, on defense, we really don't feel the pressure. But we, we just know if the offense needs us, we're going to step up, you know. So we don't feel any pressure right now. We just feel like the offense needs us. We can step up for them. Is your personal goal to be one of the best defensive backs in the SEC? Oh, yes, sir. That's my personal goal. Uh, one of my personal goals, I want that Jim Thornton. Oh, yeah. <laughs>